Hey guys, it's Michael from Premier Basement Waterproofing. I just want to talk a little bit today about the Ion Genesis battery backup sump system. So we came to this house, uh, real active system. They're getting a lot of water, iron. Uh, we've used a four inch ADS pipe and we set it at the bottom of the footing. Put a lot of ports so it can be flushed. Um, and I just want to go over some of the sumps. So this is what we pulled out of here. You know, the green pumps. Um, this is the battery backup. Uh, and this is the battery backup control. Uh, I'm going to be honest with you. I used to put these in. I actually thought they were decent. They call, this is called the protector. Uh, I don't know what that's going to protect you against, but it's called the protector. So I just, I just want to bounce forward. When me and my partner went into business, we played around with a lot of stuff and we said we would only put the best system in with the best products. We're not franchise, we're not looking to cheap out, we stand behind our warranty and we had to use the best stuff. We looked at a lot of different sump systems, a lot of sub pumps, a lot of basins, a lot of battery backups and what we came up with was this Ion Genesis system was second to none. It was nothing even close that we could find. This has two pumps in it. They're both one third horsepower stainless steel those will not corrode they can sit in water all year round they won't corrode like that um you know they may need to be clean because there is iron in the water here but what happens with this is there's no moving parts there's switches digital switches that sit down in the sump basin that control when the pumps go on and off so everything's red here this will show you your water level and your set point we can adjust this in half inch increments to make these pumps go off when we want them to. The problem with traditional sub pumps is they're drawing, you know, industry standard is around 9 amps. This is drawing 3.8, so it's a lot cheaper to run. But you're getting much larger cycles out of these sub pumps, which give you obviously longer life. Um, what in, in this, what it does is it alternates pumps. So the first sump will go off. Then the second pump, then the first pump, and it alternates them so that it wears on the pumps equally. Rather than having a primary pump and a raised secondary pump, it doesn't make sense to have a sub pump that doesn't go off unless there's an emergency. These wear at the same level. Um, so the switches are controlled here, and I just want to show you real quick how quiet they are. This is about an eight foot rise, and these are pumping really what most of the industry half horsepowers are pumping. We're getting that volume, but I want to show you how quiet it is. So the water's at 6.2 inches above the switch in the basin. I'm going to lower it. I got it to 7. I'm going to go to 6.5. When I go to 6, it's going to kick on. I want you to see how quiet it is with the bit with the top off. Okay, so that's pumping. I mean, you can almost stand on top of it and not hear it. It's done cycling. 1.5 inch below the pump. Everything here, airtight. One of the things we wanted is we have our airtight floor drain in case there's a plumbing leak. We weren't worried about that. We wanted to keep this all sealed. So this has a seal on it. It's a complete seal. Even our wiring components, when they feed in, we have a seal on them. Um, and what that does is it cuts down on humidity, cuts down on moisture. Does, you don't get that damp smell. Um, a lot of subs, they smell. This is completely airtight. Uh, like I said, this this is the brain of the unit. This will tell you there's an alarm system on it. This allows you to adjust the subs levels in half inch increments from two to 24 inches. So we can basically put those sub pumps in any basin we want and control when the water goes off. A lot of people, they're going through pumps every two or three years because they're constantly going on and off and those switches, they go. They're usually the first thing to go. Uh, that's the number one failure in pumps. And also that initial burst from a sub pump, that puts the most wear and tear on a pump. With this, we're allowing the water to come up higher. Of a much, much longer cycle, but less cycles. So it's a lot less wear and tear. Uh, over here, I just want to show them. The concrete hasn't set up yet, so I have this over here. It's not plugged in. This is the converter. This is a converter box. Um, it's the Storm Pro. 
what this does is this converts when the power goes out it tells it to kick on the converter box starts to draw power and it converts it from DC power to AC power and what we found is that by doing that you're not losing power on the pump when the power goes out with plastic pumps or, or pumps like that that are tied into a regular battery what happens is as the battery stat life starts to go down so does the performance of the pump this stays true um, and I want to show you this is a double battery uh, power plus 120 phenomenal batteries and this is the converter box this is what makes it all happen when the power goes out this we, you don't have a battery backup you have a primary pump acting as a battery backup so you're not losing your feed you're not losing power this will continue to perform your sub pump as if the battery was back on the power as if the power was still on when the bat when the power does come back on this recharges the battery battery is set until the power goes out again so far and away the best sump that we could put together it's the best on the market uh, you know this is a, a really nice house and they're gonna refinish and you know the money that people are putting into their basements these days you need to have a good battery backup these sumps the basins can be fed with one pump you don't have to put two you can go to a single pump and still keep the control panel uh, but we suggest using two you know this is a very active system so everyone's a little bit different but that's the ion genesis system if you have questions or feedback uh, our website is www.premierbasement.net or you can contact us at 1-844-LIVE-DRY. Have a good day, guys.